Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. So today we are going to talk about snotty noses, coughs, colds, all those things. We're also going to talk about the products that I like to use on our baby, Magnolia, who is 10 months old, to help get over those things. If you are new to our channel, welcome, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any further videos. We have a 10 month old Magnolia. Actually, she's almost 11 months old, I can't believe it. Also check us out on Facebook and Instagram for daily Magnolia cuteness. So today I'm gonna share with you some of my favorite products that I like to use for Magnolia when she has a runny nose, cold, cough, She's actually going through one right now. She has a really bad runny nose and an awful cough. I mean, it sounds really bad, but she's just working on getting all that junk out. So one of the first things that we really like to use are the Baby Frida nose wipes. And we used to use the boogie wipes. Um, they have like the natural like saline ones and then they also have ones that are like grape flavor, grape scented, not flavored, you don't want to eat those, <laughs> grape scented. But I saw these at Bye Bye Baby the other day. Um, Frida Baby is a very well known brand. So I thought I would give it a try because this has eucalyptus in it. It kind of has like that menthol-y kind of smell to it, which really helps open up the nasal passages and kind of get stuff going. So we tried these out and we are really, really liking them so far. We actually like to use them on ourselves as well. So these work really great. Talking about the nose Frida, we actually don't use the nose Frida. We use the plunger um, that you get from the hospital. This just seems to work the best. We're able to get the best like long suck out of it. Whenever, like, I don't know if it's just me or what, but I've tried like a nasal aspirator and I try, I just can't suck in enough. It's like I'm not getting as long of a suck as this. This really doesn't bother her, um, but I do suggest getting these. It doesn't even have like a brand. The one that they give you in the hospital, it's the blue ones. The end part is a lot wider. And these work better. We do have some of the white ones that you can get at like Target or Walmart. They do not work. They are too narrow, so it doesn't like fill up their whole nose hole. And so the blue one, this is what you guys need. Um, and also we just clean it um, every day. We just put some soapy water, like the same soap that we use like to wash her bottles. And we suck it up in here and we close the hole and we shake it and we squirt it out, we suck up some more, shake it, and then we suck up just plain water and shake it, and we keep doing that until the water has no more soap in it. So they're fairly easy to clean, I like this. To go along with that though, we really like the Little Remedies saline spray slash drops. It doesn't spray at all, like you have to, like it doesn't have like a thing where you kind of push down to spray it. We just usually tilt her back a little bit, stick it up her nose, and then squeeze. And it just shoots out a little bit of saline. This just really helps to loosen up any of that icky, snotty stuff. It just helps loosen it so you can go in with your plunger and get it all out. Because that is the most important. Babies just, they don't know how to get it out. And so it just goes down the back of their throat and then that's why they're coughing so much. So get out all the boogies. Now to help with the cough, I like two different products. The first is the Highlands Baby Mucus and Cold Relief. This is what I normally give her like during the day to kind of help break up the mucus and um, help with her runny nose. But at night, I really like the Zarbi Babies cough syrup. Um, <laughs> Magnolia is awake, I might have to go get her. So we really like the Zarbi Naturals Baby Cough Syrup and Mucus. Um, this one is really great because it's thick 
It's almost like honey, but it's not honey. This is safe. Yeah. This is safe for babies under one that can't have honey. It uses um, agave, I believe. Yes, agave and... Uh-huh, you telling them? This one's your favorite. It says, organic agave and ivy leaf extract help your baby to clear mucus when they are coughing. It's just really thick and it coats her throat. So I usually give her this at night before she goes to bed just to help um, kind of soothe that throat so she's not coughing all night. They also make a nighttime version. They make like a daytime and nighttime. Yeah. Um, but I just got like the general one. Yeah, you like that one, huh? What about this? You like this too. Is that one your favorite? Cause it feels good when mama rubs it. So this is also by Zarbi's Natural Baby. And this is the soothing chest rub. It smells so good. It is like a VIX, but for babies, and I just rub it on her chest, I rub it on her feet, and then I put socks on. I should also put it on her back, but I haven't put it on her back this time yet. But um, it has eucalyptus, lavender, and beeswax, and it's safe for, in for infants two months and older. And it smells so good, and it just, it really just opens you up, opens up your nose. Sometimes I even put some on your nose. Don't I? I put it right there on your nose. Uh-huh, you want some on your nose? Boop. <laughs> yeah. So that just helps her breathe, and it smells really, really good. So we really like that. And then kind of along the same lines as, like, smelling things. Um, yes. And those kind of vapors that kind of help open everything up. I like to use peppermint essential oils. This one is from Now Essential Oils, 100% peppermint. And I really like to use this with my other favorite thing, which is a humidifier. And we use the Lavoite humidifier, and I believe I've done a review on it, so I will try to link it down below or in the eye in the sky for you. Uh huh. Yeah, we really like to use that one. Because it does have a little compartment on the bottom where you can put essential oils. So just depending on what she needs, I can put different essential oils on. So like right now with her cold, I like to use the peppermint. And I put that on before I turn on her diffuser or her humidifier. And it it's kind of like a giant diffuser pretty much. Um, but I really, really like that. And plus you can put other scents in it. Like I can put lavender in it anything I need. So that is another one of our favorites. If you guys have any favorite products that you like to use on your little one when they have a cold or a cough, let us know in the comments below, especially a cough, because this little girl has a very bad cough and we just can't seem to make it go away. But it doesn't bother her any, huh? Yeah, it doesn't bother you any. Hey, I'm still so, so happy. I'm so, so happy. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, definitely if you have any other products that you enjoy using, leave it in the comments below so I can check them out and then anyone else who's looking for stuff can check it out. Alright guys, that's going to be it for us today. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big, give it a thumbs up. Thumbs up. Say thumbs up. Thumbs up. And we will see you guys next time. Bye. Yeah. There you go.